Hello guys, today I am going to explain you briefly a tutorial about one of the best screen recorders or video editors which is called Camtasia as you can see here. Uh, so you can try a free trial period they guys are providing and purchase if you like liked it. So hopefully you will like it. Let's go to the brief tutorial. So once you launch the application click on import media to select video or audio files you want to edit and select open so that it gets added to the library here which we call it as media bin drag the video to the timeline you can drag anywhere to this section I want to add two more clips to combine the video. So for this, we'll go to file menu and import media. So otherwise you can directly click on control I, which is shortcut to open the media. And I will add multiple videos, which can be accomplished by holding control button. Click on open. Again, drag and drop it on timeline. So this is the view of the timeline, which can be scrolled and view. So if you want to shrink this timeline, if your project is small, you can adjust the size here. So I'll make this so that I don't need to scroll even for smaller projects. Once you are here. We are ready for editing. We haven't added audio yet, which I'll come to later. I'll come to that part later. Let's select the first clip to highlight it, and let's hit on play. So here I have some recorded audio which is not clear, and I don't want it. So obviously I have to remove it or less lessen the noise. So for this. Once I select the video track, I will have this right part highlighted where I will select the volume button and reduce the sound completely to zero. See now I don't have any audio of recording. I will do the same thing with the other two. Now I want to trim the video part and remove unnecessary. So I want to start my video from here. So once your video clip is selected, you have this split button highlighted. Click on it to split the video at that part, at that point of time. And you can select this and directly hit delete button on keyboard to delete or right click on that and you can select delete which removes that part here it is i want to do the same thing and then i want up to here and again select the video clip to highlight the split button and click on split now i want to remove the right side part so i'll Same for the other two clips. I want the video from here. And select the video, highlight the split button, click on split, delete. And do the same in the end. Up to here is enough. Split. Now I have trimmed the video for my needs. You can drag them to close so that there is no black screen in between. 
which is caused by these gaps. Anyhow, I'll leave some blanks between these clips to add some text fields. For that, go to annotations and select on the last one which says ABC and you can obviously try the other options. I'll select the one and drag it to the timeline and double click it to select the select and highlight the font section and again double click it to edit or decrease the size with this by holding and dragging you can play around with the fonts you can play around with the size you can choose multiple colors and there is a feature called horizontal and vertical spacing. Vertical spacing is to increase the spacing between multiple lines and horizontal spacing between the letters within the same line. So I will increase this to have some better look. And I will increase the size as well. Now it's done. You can simply right click it and copy. Paste anywhere on the track for the other two video clips. And drag them to exactly sit in the gaps of the video. You can put it on any track. It doesn't matter. Now go to the other options and you can actually edit them. Double click to select the test and edit them. Now if you want to add special effects to your text, you can go to behaviors and drag them onto the text which is added to the track earlier. You can see how it plays. So this is the template I have selected and you can choose different styles to the other texts or leave it as is. Now I want to if I want to improve the video quality and brightness select the video track that you want and go to modify add effect visual effects and select color adjustment. You can play around with multiple options here but color adjustment is the most required one select it as soon as you select it you can see this is black and white we need to adjust the brightness contrast and saturation on the right side pane to bring back our color so brightness and slightly decrease and contrast i'll bring almost this range. Saturation is the one which needs to be adjusted to bring the color back. You can put as much as color you want. For me, it 
thing is uh, I can manually input the number I want. I'll do the same for other two videos. This looks good. And my video is almost ready without the audio. Now you can do the same thing for the audio by selecting Ctrl I. Just the length. It's better to have the same length as of the video. There's a reason I can feel my heart stop beating. And the air gets stuck just breathing. I'm alone, but I'm still feeling my audio is good and it's almost finished. save the project as save as if you want to add more videos and audio to the same project otherwise you can directly click on share and local file to save your video you can select the quality and pixel size click on next give some name path where your video is stored if you want subfolders you can check this box otherwise none you can click on finish your video gets converted I have passed the video on the this is completely converted. Now your video should be located in the path, default path we have shown it here. Let's go to documents. There is a folder named Camtasia and you can find the one gym workout that we have made. Let's open it with VLC media player and here is your video. Here are the 
text effects we have added. And thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you.